exactly data science skills do people pick up? So what are some of the programming languages or the tools that you end up using at, at your job at Google? So back when I had started, I actually started with just SQL and R, honestly, and then Python picked up a little after that. So I never got my hands dirty with Python, honestly. So I think uh, SQL is, I personally feel, one of the most uh, widely used languages, and it's very easy yet scalable. That's my personal views on SQL. And apart from that, definitely having R or Python in your kitty helps. I mean, it's uh, either or sort of a case. Python, yes, has much more flexibility compared to R, but it's eventually down to, I think, having your logics right and knowing what you want to implement at the end of the day. For that data extraction, I'm going to stick to, say, SQL because the data in these companies are so large that you will eventually have to drill down to SQL at any point of time. And then uh, you need R and or Python or having both of them is also a pretty good deal. You need to be able to make data pipelines so that, you know, the solution that you implement, you can implement it at a very big scale. Data visualization is something that's really important because you need to show insights, you need to keep a track of things, what you've built on and make sure, you know, uh, there's some sort of alerts that are sent out in case there's something wrong that goes in the entire system. Data modeling, which is essentially your technical part to the statistical skills. I think we, we talked about some of these ideas and data extraction, manipulation, I think here's where SQL sort of takes into the picture extraction and manipulation. And then probably for pipeline building or even for manipulation, probably Python or R. And for visualization, probably Tableau or whichever uh, Google Data Studio, I think that's that's what you would be using at Google. And for modeling again, I think Python or R, whichever one works. Thanks for that. Any 